Hello everyone, let's start with question number 4. So, it says classify the following numbers as rational or irrational with justification. So, first of all, the number hai, we have is under root 196. Now, 196 ko kaise reduce kar sakte hai? You can write it as 14 square. Now, square se under root cancel kar do, you get 14. And 14 is a rational number. Let's move on to the other one. It is 3 under root 18. अब under root 18 को simplify करते हैं और लिखते हैं 3 into 3 into 2. अब now you can write 3 into 3 as 3 square. So you get square and under root cancelled here. So you get 3 into 3 under root 2. So this is 9 under root 2 which is irrational number. Let's move on to the other one. So 9 over 27 under root. So 9 and 27 can be cut down. So you get 1 over 3 under root which is a rational number because now we can not simplify it next is under root 28 over 343 now how can we define under root 28 ko kaise you can write it as 7 into 4 over under root 7 into 7 into 7 so first of all 7 and 7 ko cancel kar dete. so at the numerator you get under root 4 over under root 7 square. A 4 ko kaise lik sakte hai? You can write it as 2 square. And at the bottom we have under root 7 square. Square and under root gets cancelled out. So you get 2 over 7 which is in the form of p by q and therefore it is rational number. Let's move on to the other one that is the fifth part. Fifth part is minus under root 0 0.4 how you can define this is you can define as define this as 4 over 10 under root 4 over 10 or 4 over 10 ko kaise lik sakte hain we can write it as 2 over 5 ab isse zyada simplification to nahi ho sakti iski so therefore this is a rational number let's move on to under root 12 and under root 75 अब under root 12 और under root 75 को थोड़ा सा कोशिश करते हैं simplify करने की. So under root 12 can be written as 3 into 2 square. 75 can be written as 3 into 15. No, not 15. It will be 3 into 5, 6, 3 into 6. Sorry, 6 into 15. Or you can write it as under root 3 into 2 square. Or 75 ko kaise lik sakte hain? 6 ko kaise lik sakte hain? You can write it as 3 into 2. Into 50. So 3 se 3 cancel ho gaya aapka. Or 8 2 se 8 2 cancel ho gaya. So you get under root 2 at the numerator and you get under root 15. So this is irrational number. Kyunki isko hum reduce or nahi kar sakte. Let's move on to 7th part. So, 7th part is 0 0.5918. So, as you can see that this is a terminating number. Terminating number kaun se hote hain? Kaun si category ke hote hain? Rational number hote hain. Kyunki, hum isko kaise lik sakte hain? We can write it as 5918 divided by 4 zeros. So, this is in the form of P by Q. So, therefore, it is rational number. Ab baari aati hai 8th ki. So we have 1 plus under root 5 minus 4 plus under root 5. So you have to open the brackets. So it will be minus 4 minus under root 5. Under root 5 say under root 5 cancel karo. You get 1 minus 4 which is minus 3. Minus 3 is rational number. Let's move on to other one. Other one is ninth one is 10.124. 124. Now, we can write it as 10.124 bar on it. Because 124 bar bar repeat. Ho so, therefore, bar on it. And bar wale kaun, kaun se hai they are rational number. Next, we move. So, here we have a bar ni form because it is 0 1 hai, kabhi double 0 1 hai, kabhi triple 0 1 hai. So, this bar bar repeat. Nahi ho rahe. Therefore, this is non terminating one and non-repeating uh, non as well. So therefore they are irrational number. So this is the answer for question number 4.
Thank you for watching this. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.